Hello everyone. You might be trying to figure out how you can turn off liquid glass on your iPad. Now on iPad, iPadOS 26.1, there's a couple ways to do this. So if you're on the latest version of iPadOS 26, go ahead and update because that will go ahead and kind of fix this for the most part. Now, number one, the main way to go and address this and kind of do this is by going inside of your settings application. And then what you're going to want to do on the left side, you want to go down to display and brightness. Tap right into there. You want to tap on liquid glass, which is right here. And you want to go from clear to tinted. If you tap on the tinted portion, it's going to go through and tint a little bit more of your liquid glass kind of stuff. So system wide, it's going to be a little bit more tinted. It's going to be a little bit more, slightly more tinted, nothing crazy, but you might like that a little bit more. Now, if you want the actual like full on tint, you can also go back to clear right here. You can go into your accessibility settings on your iPad. You can then go through and display and text size. And there's a little option called reduce transparency. You can go through and toggle that on, and then it's going to be even more like, you know, tinted. So it's going to show you even more toggles like that. And it's going to be a lot more tinted all throughout. So you have a couple of options you can either do with the standard tint inside of the display and brightness option here, or you can go into accessibility and change that tint here. So that's basically how you do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button. That would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so then.